40 beach this year. You'll see the pace hopping up a little bit there now as we go up along to the grades. A bit more experience have been around the block a little bit more. So up the neck, it's Alex Butler. He's already up the neck there around the back of the head on stand number two. The left hand is here, Podrick there on stand number one. James there, another left hand is here. He's here on stand number three. And Matthew there on stand number four. The first of the four sheep. But always remember, it's not necessarily the fastest competitor. Of course, the judges here on the board, you see in the white coats, they're looking for any second cut you do in the wool to make sure you take out the sheep out of the pen properly, put each short sheep away properly. On a whole time, so they're shearing in competition on the farm, demo or whatever, we have to look after the welfare of the animal a whole time. So, the judges here on the boards are looking for all those things. And the only two people can put the stop for is the competitor or the judge. Nobody else can interfere or you will be penalised. So, You've got a lot to look out for when you're judging on the board. Out the back end, they're looking for a nice even level finish job with no ridges left of the sheep, a bit of tassels of wool. And the pantry strokes of the board are divided by the number of sheep, and that gives you whole points. The same out the back. And then the time is 1 and 20 for the board go until you pull the cord when you finish the final sheep. So that's what our judges are after, that's what they're looking for. And it's the competitor, or competitors with the lowest score will get through to the final or with a low score will win that competition. So you're watching Project Co and Alex Butler, James Norton, and the match of there. You're yeah, turning the cards there, Kieran, for Porrick. Already with two sheep on the board there, Alex Butler, two on the board. James Norton goes in for number two. Number one, he's on his third sheep with that final sheep still in the pen. Yes, a good semi-final here, but it's Alex Butler. He comes out now with his fourth. And final lamb on the board, hoping to make that intermediate final later on in the afternoon. Very little between stands three and four, they're down in the long blows, a left and a right handed shear there as they battle it out. Who's going to get the turn first? And it's James gets the turn, just one blow ahead of Matthew. Coming down the last side, he's Podrick there, another left handed shearer. Right down to the flank he goes, now the back leg. Another two or three blows. He'll send that sheep. Out into the... That is four sheep. Is that his last sheep, Paddy? Hello? Is that four his last sheep? Turn the cards, boys. It's the is final he sheep, one is left, it? Is he one left? Is one left in the bin, or is one left? Yeah. Out it comes the final sheep. So we'll have that number flicked over. The final sheep coming out for James there as well. The final sheep will be coming out for Matthew. And we have the final sheep on the board there with Alex. He's on his last lamb there. He gets the turn down to the shoulder and down the last side he comes now. A bit of a wriggler there with Podrick, seconds are down and away he goes again. But it's Alex Butler that it is, so he's fourth and final land, the first in the intermediate semis. Down to the flank he goes and out the back leg. Once he pulls that cord, his time, the clock will stop and his time will be taken. That's so, why it's so important to have those numbers right. And it's Alex Butler. Yes, his time is taken now. Yeah, good shearing there from young Alex Butler. He's hoping to make the final later on. James Norton, all these shearers have all their four sheep on the board. Pony caught up there, the left hander. He's shearing on one. Drops down in the long blow up there. The left hander shearer, making a good job of that lamp. James Norton steps over. He's another left hander shearer up there as well. And Matthew Conboy, he has four on the board as well. Matthew Conboy there having a good shear. Drops into the long blow there. Down for home comes James Norton with his fourth and final sheep on the board. Corey Cole is a bit of a wriggler up there, a bit of a Michael Flatley. But he doesn't want to ever dance and ladies and gentlemen, he wants to get that wool off her. James Norton, down the last side comes Jamesy. Having a good, good cheer up there, Corey Cole down the last side. Matthew Conway there, he's going to turn for home as well. But it's all about James Norton, ladies and gentlemen. A couple of flicks over the tail head, he's hoping to make the final later on. Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen, young Jamesy. Well done, James, good cheer. Down the last side comes Corey Cole up there, nothing between stands number one and four. Matthew Conway. Pori Conway, or Pori Cole, having a good cheer. Matthew Conway, a couple of flicks, out the flank and away he goes there. Pori Cole, keeping the bottom tooth on the skin, bit of a wriggler there for Matthew. Put your hands together for young Pori Cole, the Galway man. Well done, Pori. Matthew Conway there, out the flank and away he goes there with his fourth and final sheep on the board. Well done, lads, for the first heat of first semi of the intermediate. Off to the right-hand side, please, and we'll be ready for the second leg of the intermediate semi.